we are going to present SCAM, transferring humans between image and with semantic cross-attention modulation. We aim at replacing a subject from one image with the subject from another image. Achieving good subject transfer could allow several applications such as stuntman replacement in movies with the desired actor. We tackle the subject transfer task via semantically guided generation. Semantic marks allow for fine-grained editing which facilitates subject transfer. In the literature, several works do semantically guided image generation. Among them, Spade managed to semantic control the output of a gun. However, Spade used only a single style code for the whole image. Sin improves over Spade by introducing a single style code per semantic label. However, this can still be restricted for coarse semantic labels. Instead, our work addressed both limitations introduced by Spade and Sin. We propose an encoder generator architecture that separates different semantic regions into multiple style codes. We begin with an image to encode a fixed set of long latent codes and a semantic mass associated to the image. For each latent, we assign a semantic label such that each semantic label has a fixed subset of latent assigned. We extract information from the image return encoder, the semantic attention transformer encoder. Our encoder is based on the SAT operation with leverage semantic cross attention. SCA allows computing attention between two sets of tokens, where we allow tokens to interact with only each other only if they correspond to the same semantic region. The SAT operation is a transformer-like block where attention is replaced with SCA. SAT is first used in, the, in a cross-attention fashion where latents retrieve information on the image feature in a semantically constrained manner. Then the latents are refined with self-attention SAT. Here, the latents interact only with latents sharing the same semantic label. We also use a stride convolution to encode the input feature map so that the next feature map has a smaller spatial resolution. To perform the generation process, we introduce the semantic cross-attention modulation generator, or SCAM. SCAM leverages multiple latents per semantic region to improve the image generation. We will first describe the SCAM block, which aims to transfer information from the latents to the feature map. We update the latents according to the previous layer feature map with a SAT operation with cross-attention. Then we use the latent cause to update the feature map with a SCA operation. Finally, we modulate the last layer of feature map by the results of the SCA operation. We upscale the resulting feature map and pass it to the new scan block. To generate the image, we use an auxiliary branch that works on RGB space. We train our architecture on a reconstruction task. The goal of the encoder and generator is to generate an image similar to the input. We use a perceptual loss and a L1 loss. We also add a GAN loss to enforce realism in the image. Now we are going to discuss the results. We observed that SCAM offers a better reconstruction that is more faithful to the original image. This is particularly true when looking at the background. Here we can see that SCAM has better face reconstruction and better re background reconstruction. SCAM also achieves better results on more complex data sets such as ida 2 k SCAM managed to transfer complex subjects such as in the second row where SCAM rotates the subject and other methods fail. The increased capacity of SCAM allows capturing more complex styles than the previous state of the art like the hair on the first row. SCAM is the only method to correctly transfer the HUD style in the first row. It also managed to change the style of the couches in the second row. When visualizing the attention matrices of SCAM, we observe that our system has learned unsupervised semantic information. We also apply SCAM to a video and observe that SCAM managed to reconstruct the movement better than seen, which we observe particularly well when the model turns. SCAM is capable of doing subject transfer in videos. Both the background and the subject are well transferred, which is not the case for scene. Our method SCAM achieves state-of-the-art results on iDesigner, Selvay Mascache Q, and ADO Tronica for semantic image generation and subject transfer. We introduce SCAM a state-of-the-art method for in semantic image generation. The SAT encoder extracts multiple latents per semantic region. The SCAM generator leverages the latents to discover new semantic knowledge and improve the image generation. Thank you for your attention.